What is up YouTube? Clickwood here back again with another Madden 15 Ultimate Team pack opening video and today guys what we're going to be opening is a couple of game changer packs and also a few pro packs trying to look for this new MVP Aaron Rodgers. It's been in the game almost an entire day now. Um, obviously it's a 24 hour card. I'm getting down here with the final minutes and I'm just hoping that maybe, maybe because there's only a couple minutes left for this thing to be pulled that maybe I will have some extra luck. So, first thing that I'm going to do here is I'm going to go in, I'm going to open up one pro pack just to get it out of the way, and then we're going to open up the game changer. So, let's do that first. I'm going to do two game changer packs, and then we're going to do uh, one pro pack first, start that off, and then, uh, like I said, the two game changers, and then we'll wrap it up with probably three more pro packs. So, wish me luck here, guys. We're looking for this Aaron Rodgers. Anything, anything elite would be more than acceptable, though, at this point, to be honest with you. So, all right, so we get our first pack out of the way, and we only get a Brent Selleck, so really not much of any value here to start things off, but we didn't really expect anything. Now we're going to get into the game changers. This is where I think we have a real chance. So here we go, 70,000 coins. These things are really not worth it to open, but thankfully I have a couple of decent amount of coins. Um, so first thing we get is a haha -ha Clinton Dix, and then we get an 88 camera wake in elite. So nice We are a at least able to get an elite. I don't think that goes for a whole lot anymore, but hey, it's an elite It's an elite. I'm happy to get an elite at this point uh, gold badge. Not too bad. Brian Robeson Stanley Havili uh, Darren Sproles Paul Soleil Another Stanley Havili. What the hell? Denario Alexander and then a Jake Cutler. So uh, not the worst pack. I know Haha -Ha Clinton Dix is pretty decent and Cameron Wake. I'm definitely happy about that. So here we go, guys. Last chance trying to pull the Aaron Rodgers last chance realistically because the pro packs probably not gonna happen in the pro packs. But here we go, guys. Seventy thousand coins for these packs is crazy, man. Unless you pull the Aaron Rodgers, it's pretty much not worth it. But we got to give it a chance. Oh, Shane Vereen, Football Outsiders. That's pretty decent at least. That's not a bad pull. I'm, I'm happy with that. And another elite, Jason Witten. Two elites in one pack. Let's go, baby. And a gold badge. Okay. T.Y. Hilton. Actually, I forgot. I think the gold badges are guaranteed in these packs, if I remember correctly. So I shouldn't be excited about that. But uh, at least we got a couple of elites here. Ramon Foster. Rob Ninkovich. Oh, Earl Thomas, though, at least. Oh, my gosh. Three elites in one pack. Are you kidding me? Holy shit. That is insane. I am blown away right now, guys. That is that is craziness. I, I have never gotten anywhere near that many elites in one pack. Holy cow. That's insane. I am very, very happy about that. Um, you know what? I'm going to try and see if I can add some points real quickly here, guys. And, and we're going to do a bundle. So uh, give me just a moment here and we'll uh, we'll go ahead and do that. All right, guys, we're back, and the reason that we're doing the five Game Changer Pack bundle now is because I got three elites in one pack, and I'm just feeling it right now. I'm feeling it. I feel like we're going to be able to get something out of out of these packs. So, I mean, these things are, are really, really expensive, but you know what? Let's try and get them, and, and we'll see what we can do here. Wish me luck, guys. I'm definitely going to need it. Um, I have a Super Bowl topper pack. I don't even know what I, what I get in this. I completely forget. What do I even get? Malcolm Smith INT. Oh, and a huge upside. Okay, so that actually comes with the uh, with the game changer pack or with the bundle, I believe. So uh, we got at least a couple of uh, of decent collectibles here. So let's hop into it and we'll see what we get in the actual game changer packs. Sam Shields, Ray McDonald. Man, I'm I don't know. I don't know if it's worth it. We'll we'll have to see here. Uh, I got all those elites in that one pack, and that might have got me a little over anxious. Gary Williams, Broncos offense. Oh my gosh, Jonathan Joseph. Ah, oh, I saw red and I was really excited for a minute. Randall Cobb, another elite. Mike Upati, let's go, baby. Steven Nicholas. Okay, so what is that out of the ga these game changer packs? Six elites or something like that, I think, with the Cameron Wake and the three that I got in the other packs. So not bad, man. We're getting some elites here at least. Um, I know obviously these aren't going for very much. Jonathan Joseph, I don't think, goes for much. Mikey Potty might go for a decent chunk because he's one of the best run blockers in the game, if I remember correctly. Uh, yeah, 94 run block. But look at that pass block, though. 73. That is just terrible. I can't believe that they dis disrespect him like that. Uh, he is absolutely one of the best run blockers in this football game, though. So, um, he, he goes for a decent, a little amount, you know, considering that he's not a, a legend or anything like that. 
All right, next game changer pack. We've got, like I said, about six elites, I think, so far. Ninkovic again. I already got him in a pack. Oh, maybe I can get one of those Clinton Dixes, and then uh, maybe we'll make a rising star Clinton Dix. Put him on the bench. I don't think he'd, he'd really start on my team right now. Julian Edelman rolled to the playoffs. Hussein Abdullah. Stefan Gilmore. Gio Bernard. Come on, guys. Alex Smith. Oh, my gosh. This pack is terrible. All right, let's go to this, this last one from the back. No elites yet in this pack. But we get Revis. Nice. There it is. There's the elite. I don't think Revis goes for a ton anymore. Um, when I first pulled him, I think it was in the Cornucopia pack. He was going for like 80,000 or something like that. I don't think he's going for anywhere near that anymore, but at least we get an elite. So that's another elite in these packs, man. Uh, pretty decent. I'm, I'm pretty happy with that. Still looking for that Aaron Rodgers, though. I mean, at the end of the day, it really comes down to do you pull one of the really, really expensive cards or not? Because if you don't get one of those, I mean, it's really hard to make your coins back, to be honest with you, or in this case, your money back. It's really, really hard. So hopefully we're able to get something like that, but I am happy that we're at least pulling some elites. So Jeremy Lane is uh, Football Outsiders Elite, so that's pretty decent. Um, I don't know exactly what his attributes are here. Let's take a look here. 92 for man, 87 for zone, not great, but he is six foot tall. He does have 94 speed, 95 excel, so... Uh, not bad. I, I don't think that he goes for a whole lot right now at the moment, but uh, still a pretty decent pull. Charles Godfrey, Ahmad Brooks. Let's go from the back. That worked last time. Gold badge. Alfred Morris, 49ers away jersey. Jed Collins. Come on, guys. Come on. Michael Lower. We did get a rising star, Luke Wilson. I think that that's a... I mean, it's not going for a ton, but if you actually make that rising star, Luke Wilson, he starts on my team as one of my two tight ends, so he's a pretty decent card. And then the final pack of, or card of the pack, Connor Barwin, so not a great pack here. Didn't really get a whole lot. Uh, Jeremy, Jeremy Lane's our only elite out of this pack. I, I, like I said, I don't think he's going for a whole lot right now. I'll have to check that after the video, but um, yeah. All right, here we go. Janoris Jenkins, Sports Authority Field, Fonzo Denard, come on. And Dominic Riola, man, when I see that red, I'm like, Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. And then we don't get a whole great player. But uh, at least we got an elite. Aaron Williams. And a gold badge. Rasheen Mathis. Vince Wilfork. That 85 Wilfork is a beast. Trust me, guys. And Tony Pachos. Okay, so I think we are down to our final game changer pack now, guys. So it's really coming down to this one. If we're going to get anything decent in this pack, we'll probably make our coins back. If we don't get something decent, then we probably don't make our coins back. So... Wish me luck here, guys. We're going to need it. James Ahedigbo, Brandon Williams, Antoine Kaysen. Come on, Trent Williams. Oh, when I see that red, man, it's like you just get this anxiety just instantly in your body, and it just makes you wish that you could pull something epic. Come on, Jonathan Goodwin, Gold Badge, Matt Elam, Dwayne Allen, and we are down to our final card, guys. So Trent Williams, come on, Aaron Rodgers. I know you're still in this pack. I know you're still in here, baby. Oh, Vince Wilfork. Oh, man. So at least we got, I mean, at least we got a couple of elite cars out of these packs. Um, I mean, I've been complaining about that for quite some time now, that it is just ridiculously hard to pull just base elite cars that are going for like 15,000 coins. And at this point, I mean, in Madden, they should really be a lot more possible to pull. I mean, come on, but um, I'm very, like I said, I'm very, very happy that we were able to pull a couple of those. Um, that is definitely going to make some uh, decent cards for us to do on Pink Slips today. If you guys are watching this today on Saturday, yes, we are doing Pink Slips again this week. Uh, Saturday, what is it, February 7th, 2015, we are doing Pink Slips. So make sure that you guys head over to twitch.tv forward slash TV at 2 o'clock p.m. Central Time. We will start and uh, we'll get the stream going around that time. Pick an opponent. Uh, we'll probably do some sort of trivia question or something like that. Maybe it'll be something to do with this actual pack open video for those of you who are a YouTube follower as well so be sure to head over to that stream you'll have a chance to play me for some pretty nice cards possibly something that you saw here today although I'm not sure that any of these cards is going for a whole lot but we'll take a look at them and uh, kind of analyze it from there and see if any of them are worthwhile to do for a pink slips video otherwise probably sell them off and maybe do some coin games or things like that on the stream so 
Thank you guys again for tuning in. Hope you enjoyed the Game Changer bundle opening and some extra packs as well. Um, I had a lot of fun doing it. Probably lost a quite a bit of coins here because I don't think I got anything that's worth a whole lot. But it was still fun to do the pack opening. Maybe I will do another pack opening today because I'm hearing rumors that Mike Vick is going to be in the game. Like an epic Mike Vick with like 99 speed and like 99 throw deep accuracy and stuff like that. So that could be an absolutely ridiculous card. That might be the first actual like game-breaking card that they put into Madden. Although I know a lot of people talk about Bo Jackson, but dude... Seriously, if they put a 99 Vic, uh, 99 speed Vic with 98 or uh, 99 throw deep and uh, 99 throw power and things like that, that card is going to be out of freaking control real, real fast. So, uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like I said, if you did, please be sure to click that like button below. Subscribe to this channel if you're new. And again, be sure to check out twitch.tv forward slash TV today at 2 p.m. And you guys will be able to watch me play live on stream. So, thank you guys. And I will talk to you guys at 2 o'clock p.m.